but yes, the time has come. It is the day of Elden Ring DLC. I'm very excited to uh, to dig into it. So I should, I mean, I should have a good, like, at least, like, five, six hours to give to this tonight. Tomorrow, I'm going to try and stream most of the day. Um, and then I think, actually, I said maybe not Saturday, but I think maybe Saturday I will, and then Sunday I'll take a break. <laughs> but Jesus, we'll see. We'll see how this all goes. Um, I am ready. The question is, is Chin Carey ready? I think so. I think he is ready. And, uh, and you'll see why. All the big names are streaming right now, but I'm going to watch you instead. Yeah, dude, I'm totally like, I actually feel like the meta, if, if I were to care about viewers at all, I think the meta would be to be the one guy. Oh yeah, please uh, pin a no spoiler message. I actually have that ready. Exclamation mark backseating. Pin it. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I feel like the meta would be to be the one guy that's not streaming Elden Ring right now, but... It won't be me today because I I just I want to play Elden Ring and I don't care if I get zero viewers while doing it. I care a little bit. Um, I care a little bit, but it seems like that's not going to happen. So uh, the people, they want the anchor. They want to see the anchor. Um, that's actually not all, though. Um, I feel like it wouldn't be right for me to play some new Souls content without just a tiny little bit of a spin. Um, I wouldn't say a challenge. But a little, a little game we're going to play with the DLC here. Um, I, I, I think the DLC is going to be plenty hard enough that I will suffer. So the goal isn't to necessarily inflict uh, too much further suffering, but more to just encourage me to explore more of the DLC, if you will. Um, so here's what's going on. I'll, I'll, I'll share my screen in a second. Essentially, every 25 deaths, I'm going to spin... Both a punishment and a side quest. And I can do, I can either accept the punishment or do the side quest to clear my punishment. Um, and here's what that will look like. Um, hold up. Sorry, I got juggling scenes, OBS scenes here. Boom. Punishment or side quest. Very rare center face cam as well. Um, so we, uh, and honestly, if anyone has suggestions for this, feel free to put them in the discord. The punishments are more just like to get me to change up my equipment a little bit. Uh, no, there's no punishments like that. No, nothing related to getting over it, especially. Um, but I'll spin both wheels. I will pick one. Um, I'll try my best to keep track of it on the screen. I have a little thing on my, uh, on my Elden Ring overlay for it. So... It should be a fun time, and this this is a nice consolation. Since I'm planning on running through the DLC with the anchor, this is a nice way to get me to like check out new weapons and new incants and stuff like that. So hopefully, this encourages me to you know see more of the DLC and stuff like that. Um, so that is the goal. Let's just get in the game. I'm I'm already tired of waiting. <laughs> I'm already tired of waiting. It's it's been I've waited for two years, and I don't want to wait a second longer. So let's let's play this John. I, I have no earthly idea how long this is going to take me either. I heard I think Iron Pineapple said he cleared it in 40 hours. That's my only frame of reference here. Um I would say I'm probably worse at the game than Iron Pineapple. <laughs> um that that kind of goes without saying. But we'll see. I'm not planning on just speed running through it either. This is going to be a, a, a slow and steady casual playthrough here. I'm, try, I'm trying to see as much as possible. I'm trying to hit all the bosses, at least all the remembrances. Um, and yeah. All right. Take pineapple's time and double it. And there you got the play time. I, d I don't think I am <laughs> that much worse. <laughs> I think I think I'll fare okay. I'm not trying to get my expectations up too high. Uh, the question is, how long will I take to to do like side stuff? Let's turn that volume up. Hell yeah. Um, load game. Chin carry, Lyurnia of the Lakes. I guess is where I left off. Oh yeah, I <laughs> I know exactly why I left off here. Um. And you shall all see in but a moment. The other thing, too, is my game should run a lot better now because, um, let's see. So I found out about a year ago. Where's the graphics settings? I think I skipped over it. 
display? Wait, isn't there like a graphic? Here it is. About a year ago, or maybe around when I was doing the playthrough where I first did the anchor build, they added ray tracing to the game. And for me, it was on high by default. And here I was sitting here wondering why the hell my game was running like shit all of a sudden. And like I could barely stream it without it stuttering like mad. And it turns out I had fucking ray tracing on the whole damn time. <laughs> so that is off now. The game still looks beautiful, of course. Um, I'm in the most beautiful spot in the game. But there is actually one more thing. And that is... I've got a second motherfucking anchor. Uh, a second anchor has hit the lands between. <laughs> we have never been so ready to take on the Shadows of the Earth Tree DLC than right now with two fucking anchors. Um, also, I like how it just clips right now. <laughs> you see that shit? That's funny. Um, so yeah, there we go. Second anchor. Is there anything else new? I don't think so. It's Chin Carry from the mask, yeah. Uh, so we want to go to, I guess, Mogwin? Mogwin. Not Shrek and how do- oh. Hello. Okay. Ah. Were you guided here by kindly Mikula? I- I- I guess. <laughs> and like you? You're very quiet. I need to turn you up, I think. Oh, you're not gonna force me in like Gale? <laughs> okay. Like her voice. Um, let's turn that up a little bit. Voice, yeah, just put that to 10. I may as well just go like that. Something like that. I don't know if this dude is quiet, but I can barely hear the game. Let me just turn it up in OBS, because the volume is fine for me, but... We'll do that. Hopefully that's good. And if, if it's too loud, let me know. I can turn it down again. Seems good now. Well, I did I did also just turn up the volume in-game. Alright, let's fucking do it. Touch the withered arm. Head to the realm of shadow. Head to the big tree. <laughs> you, do you realize how little that narrows it down in this game? <laughs> It's actually, uh, and here we are. Brave sight plane. It's so surreal to have new Elden Ring to play. <laughs> the Erd tree. I don't know if that is the Erd tree. It, it, it sure is a tree though. You should cut it down. Oh, torrent works here. Don't need, don't need him right now though. God, this game's fucking gorgeous. Evil Erd Tree. Evil Erd Tree is not real. It can't hurt you. When you think about it, my anchor kind of looks like a, a tree. Let's see. Okay, I'm at least medium rolling. That's good. <laughs> if I put on, like, any heavier armor, though, no shot. All right, let's go get the map. That's a that's probably a good, good way to start. Oh, big guy. Hello. Oh. Oh, hello, Sekiro enemy. Oh, I do no damage to you. That's really cool. He blocked me! Okay, well, you're not doing, like, crazy damage to me, either. <laughs> but, but you do, uh, whatever the hell that is. <laughs> Yo, he's cool. Ow. 
Dude, this is just like the Sekiro enemies, right? Am I crazy? Okay, no, don't die, don't die, don't die. Oh, I should get some Sacred Tears. I'm not at plus 12. Yeah, this is DLC. Okay. I guess, like, post-game is really relative. I mean, it's- it's- It takes place at the end game, essentially. I don't know if there is really, like, a canon order of things. I always felt like Dark Souls 3's DLCs, like, took place after the ending. But realistically, you could do them whenever you wanted. Well, not whenever, but... About whenever you want. Alright, new map. So we have, like, a big... Looks like a castle over here. Something over here as well. Some sort of, like, village or something. Where to first? I mean, I suppose, like, whatever the hell this is... It's probably worth checking out. What do you have to say? Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Everyone burned to cinders. Burned away. Put to the torch by Mesmer and his lot. What did we do to deserve such a fate? We merely lived our lives. We lived in peace. Don't worry, bro. I'm gonna take care of Mesmer. <laughs> I got 18 inches of anchor for him. Oh, hi. Ow. Rude. What do you mean you lived your lives in peace? You're just attacking a, a innocent man with two anchors. <laughs> I'm not here to hurt you. I say as I literally kill one of them. That is peace. It's about as peaceful. Hefty cracked pot. Okay. It's about as peaceful as it gets in the uh, in the lands between. Or I suppose this is the land of shadows. I... Oh wait, hang on, I got something for you. Oh yeah, so I have a different Ash of War on this anchor currently. Check this out. <laughs> I still have uh, Wild Strikes on the other one, but I got the other funny Ash of War here. <laughs> yeah, we got a big pot. I think there's like giant throwables. Greater... Potentate's cookbook? Is that how you say that? It's over here. Just nothing. I really like this area. It kind of somewhat looks like Altus, but it's very like... North Dakota looking ass. <laughs> just keep... Just keep flattening up. Alright, let's put the... Let's put the Wild Strikes one in, uh, in the main hand now. <laughs> it is fun having the lion's claw on the other one, though. Will you be switching weapons if you find something cool? Not permanently, no. No, the idea is to beat the, uh... Read the description of the thing you got. Okay. I will do whatever I want. Thank you very much. Um, are you talking about the cookbook, or... <clears throat> yeah, fuck it. I give up. I don't care. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure the cookbook just gave me, like, new crafting recipes. No, I- I, I do not want. <laughs> you- you can- you can ask me if I would like to read it, <laughs> instead of demanding that I read it. In fact, I'd prefer it. <laughs> uh, but no, I'm not- I don't think I'm gonna read too many item descriptions. I don't I can't imagine the cookbook has too much to say. I mean, I probably just got some new crafting item. Or, well, maybe I should look at it. Maybe I should look at it, if only because then I know, like, what I got from it. I don't know where- where the hell are the cookbooks even, though? Are they in crafting materials? Bruh. <laughs> oh my god, what is happening? My game just minimized. Now look at it spitefully. <laughs> I will look at it happily. Thank you very much. 
I don't even know where it is. I, I don't even know where the fuck it is. Are you like an enemy? You are. I don't- big birds scare me in this game. Oh, you're- you're not so scary. What do you mean, is it still anchor time? Anchor time just begun! Rotta fruit. It looks spiky. It looks like I could hurt someone with it. Oh, big, big worms, big glowy worms. Leave the goat alone. All the time is anchor time. For chin carry, yes. Stomach? Head? Oh, yeah, I suppose. I didn't realize I was standing on top of someone's grave. I suppose that makes sense. You blade and sorcery update goes insanely hard. I just got a, a VR headset and blade and sorcery is one of the games on my list. Um, I would like to check it out. It looks really cool. Okay, now there's two. Now there's two of them? Okay, fuck off. You guys are cool, but also I hope I want you to die. <laughs> Get rocked, bozo. How about this? How about this? up anchoring this shit. I'm definitely anchoring my shit. Thank you very much. So what is going on over here? This looks like some sort of grave. Is this like a side dungeon, maybe? If so, I may want to save it for one of my side quests. Why does my game keep freezing? I'm, I'm, it's scaring me. Something keeps minimizing my game, and I don't like that. Do I need to just go? I think I'm in like borderless window. I might just need to go like dedicated full screen. Uh, no, I am in dedicated. Let's go. Well, let's try borderless window then. The Bitcoin miner is launched. Inshallah, maybe borderless window will be better for us. Oh, this is just a boss. You know what? Fuck it. There's a Stake America out there. Black Jail Knight. You just look like a fucking... Ed Ooh! How you like that? Bro, think he Gale. Ow! Holy shit, that damage. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> okay. Well, now I know that he does that. <laughs> I, I might. Uh, it might. Nah, I don't. I don't really desperately need 30k runes. I might just save this guy. Yeah, the sword is cool. Not that I don't think I could beat him, but, uh... I might just save him for one of the side quests. Pro really is Havel 2. I don't know if that guy's Havel 2. So... Uh-huh. I can only get... Get up here. There's so much I want to do. I don't know where to begin. Make sure to kill him so you can grab his flaming assault rifle. Okay, this guy... I don't know what to think about this guy. God, fuck you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right. I just 
really go get some more sacred tears. I'm not sure where I would have left them. Oh, here's something. There's like a gateway to something. There's a grace over there. Ooh, and I think this is one of the level up things. If you drink four four locos, is it 16 locos? I guess that, yeah, mathematically. Okay, so what is this? Scattery blessing. Scattery fragments can be found across the realm of shadow. Consume these at sites of grace to bolster your scattery blessing. Uh, okay. Bolsters the recipient's abilities to deal and negate damage, but has no influence outside the realm of shadows. All right. What happens if I touch the cross? Carved words coalesce. I abandon here here the first flesh of my body. So this is something from Mikola, I assume. Interesting. So let's let's see. Am I can I do this at Grace now? Yeah, yeah. Shadow Realm blessing. Uh, consume scattered tree fragments to bolter your blessing. Yeah, yeah. What? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I was like, I was like, wait, why can't I do it? Why can't I do it? Hello. Ah, Lady Leda spoke of you. You're that tarnished. Tarnished. Coinly, Mikola. Coinly. We all? I am Freya. I once fought alongside General Radan. Okay. In battle, you can be sure I'll hold my own. So I killed Radon. Oh, another thing. <laughs> Just so you're aware. Who's that? If you've yet to do so, have him give you a map of the cross's whereabouts. You'll find more of them dotted about these. You couldn't just give me like a name or a description of of the Who is our dower friend? I I would love to speak to this person, but What do the tree fragment things do? They essentially... Oh, is this who I'm meant to talk to? Uh, they essentially allow me to, to level up, but only in the DLC. Now, what was that? Okay, that I, I would like to read the description of. Because that just appeared in my inventory without any real fanfare. Uh, it's, I mean, it's probably in key items, right? Something Empyrean blood? That's gotta be... Nope, <laughs> not in there. Uh, okay. Crafting material? I don't know. There, there's a way to like sort by recent now, isn't there? How do I do this? Uh, help. <laughs> help. Help me. <laughs> it, it said, when I booted up the game for the first time, it said that I could do that now, but I'm like, I don't know how. <laughs> I don't know how. Uh, that ain't that ain't doing it. <laughs> I give it like a week before someone mods it to work outside in the base game. I mean, you pretty much have to like beat most of the base game to even get into the uh, into the DLC. Now it did say, yeah, they would have an exclamation mark. Um, the thing is, oh, I think I saw it. Yeah, Empyrean Blood Burgeon, just exceedingly rare to find. Young shoot heavy with Empyrean blood. Material used for crafting items. Oh, it's just a crafting thing. Set to burgeon forth from where the golden blood of Mikola, the wounded Empyrean, pooled. Okay, so I'll, I will find that at these crosses. Okay, I want to talk to you. Another. It says left stick sort. The heels of then, as that woman would surely say, I think the dialogue's just quiet. I'm, I turned it up to 10. But understand, your kind are not forgiven. So I apologize if it's hard to hear. By Marika long betrayed, set aflame. You are a I dour sort. <laughs> she says our delivery will come, but never will I see your kind as worthy. Oh, a racist. Very cool. And yet my oath I cannot <laughs> overlook. If Mikkele it is whom you would seek, then comrade, allow me to give you this. These are the sights of the crosses I found. Cool. I heard you. Follow after Mikkele. As long as you abide by his footfalls, you will be no enemy to me. 
They added the racist DLC. I got bad news for you, brother. The base game is extremely racist. <laughs> Towards Tarnished, at least. Um, Horn Scent and Red Main Freya. Um, okay. Oh, this probably goes through to here. So yeah, I think I do want to go here, huh? Is it really a Soulsborne gamer expansion without racism? That's true, yeah. Ring City might, like, high-key be the most racist, like... Uh, most ra- I shouldn't say racist. Most racism-focused piece of content that uh, FromSoft has ever made. <laughs> God, this is beautiful. I mean, the, the base game looks really nice. And maybe it's just because this is new and I'm still kind of in awe, but, like, holy shit. Something over here? I, I keep thinking I see items, but all I'm actually really seeing is just gra more gravestones. From a certain angle, they kind of look like an item spot, though. Oh. Ah. <laughs> sometimes, uh, sometimes you don't need any words to tell a story. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good stuff. <laughs> uh, although I will say, getting a getting a map of here. Wait, let me look at this thing. Getting a map of where all of those are located is like, oh, do I have to actually look at the map? I was about to say that that is like extremely like uncharacteristically helpful for uh, for FromSoft, but then I realized that they make you actually like. Is someone throwing shit at me? Okay, hey. Leave me alone. Leave me alone or you're gonna get 18 inches of anchor. Bro. Okay, now I can't open my menu. <laughs> Sorry, I had to do it to you. Your collateral damage. Um, okay, let's find that map. I wanna see how this is gonna work. It's probably a key item. Oh, here's the cookbooks. This is the one. Uh, hefty fire pot. Okay, that, that sounds great. I would love to make a hefty fire pot. Um, it's not here. Ah, <sighs> okay, okay, okay. No, no, it's fine. I... I just want to know... Sort. Oh, there it is. Right here. Stop! Leave me the fuck alone, bro. I'm just trying to check. <laughs> the, uh, like the worst place to camp out. Um, order of acquisition. Okay. Well, yeah. Of course, I got that. <laughs> this is nice and all, but like, it's still, it's, it's not as helpful as it could be. Um, here we go. Maps. There it is. Stop! Fucking stop! Where are you? Are you respawning? Oh my god, you're gonna kill me. <laughs> Fucking torch hollow. Okay! It doesn't even save my place. But I, I know how to speedrun there now. Examine using X. <laughs> okay, yeah, thank you. I think I see now. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I spoke too soon. It turns out it's actually extremely unhelpful. <laughs> And it took me 10 years to open it up. Oh, well, there's another one. Hey, I know this is like a really important religious site for you guys, but I hope you don't mind if I just walk right over there and loot it. <laughs> oh. Oh, you. I abandoned. Oh, it's the same thing. I was like, I was like, is there going to be like a little bit more like of the story of Mikola at each of these? Nope. <laughs> the answer is nope. <laughs> Alright, what? How many does it take? Did I not just pick one up? Use two. Two. Okay, hello. You must be the tarnished. That's me. I am Ansbach. Formerly in service to Lord Moog. But now, like you, another soul guided by kindly Mikola. Okay, I guess that's good. I once was. I was a little bit worried you were maybe a pedophile. It's like golden seeds, yeah, but it, it seems like it scales faster. 
So far, so good. I haven't died. Oh, wait, I did die. I forgot to mark it. <laughs> Oops. Oops. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> I did die uh, to that boss in, like, the tomb there. Yo, the DLC's got a fat guy. Together, we work. I like this guy. For Mikola the kind. Together, brother. We have found. What do you sell? Lots of new crafting stuff. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Damage negation item? That's cool. Further details are only available to paid customers. I was like, there's no way if I just hit this button, it tells me exactly what it... Uh, yeah, sure, I'll buy that for a thousand runes. Goodbye. Fat guy on Dark Souls mentioned, Onion Knight flashbacks. It's, there's always gotta be one. There's gotta be one fat man. Um, okay. There's a big gate up there. I'm still downloading the game, right? It's not that big. It was like, it's like 15, 15 gigs. I guess that's not small, but... I have a bad feeling about this. He lives in Finland. Is that, does that mean you have shit internet? I guess like most of Europe has bad internet. Okay, this does not look like a boss arena. Yet. <laughs> yet. Although it looks like it could, oh, okay. So that's not a boss. It is a scary thing though, I don't like it. Oh. I'm already fucking him up. I'm already fucking him up. I'm too, the, the anchors are too strong. <laughs> I, need to, I need to nerf myself. Oh boy. Yo. So cool. Oh, lots of scorpions. Okay, hi. Don't, don't come close. I'm mowing the lawn. Are they all dead? There's one. One very, uh... Very enterprising scorpion has managed to make his way all the way to me and bite me several times. <laughs> oh, was that a bot? I was like, damn, if that was someone with spoilers, i glad I missed it. Revered Spirit Ash Blessing. Yo, I can bless the boys! Let's go! I can upgrade the boys. Yeah, you sniped him fast. Uh-oh. More of you? I mean, I'll, I'll squash y'all. Don't think I won't. Don't think I won't. Shadow Realm Rune. Okay, oh, how much does this give? Sheesh. Um, sort by type. Sort. Yeah. We good? Yeah, we're fine. Okay. 7,500. 7 TV has a band slider that you use? Interesting. I, I'm not a 7 TV user, uh, mainly because uh, I don't feel the need to have 1,500 emote slots. Uh, but maybe I need to check that out for some of the features that it has. Oh, another big boy? Fake wall. Uh, I'll check it out. Yeah, I didn't read the messages. That's a good point. Actually, yeah, if they <laughs> that looks like a that looks like an illusory wall if there ever was one. Liar ahead. All right, I'm hitting it anyways. <laughs> the spider dudes look cool. Yeah, they're like scorpions, but they're they're freaky. They got little hairs on them. I don't like it. Which which means it's a good design. <laughs> The ones that really bother me are the are the ants. Uh, the ants in this game are freaky as hell. Be wary of right. Be wary of right. Be wary of right. Hi. They were right. They didn't lie to me. Don't tell me. Liar. Hidden path ahead. <laughs> I'm gonna try. 
This was a dilemma that we had in, uh... In Dark Souls 2, where it was like, if I try for a hidden wall, does it count as a, uh... Fort's evening? I was like, if I try for a hidden wall, does it count as a, uh... As me falling for a... For a message, like a, a troll message. And I was like, I feel like it can't, because it's so easy to, like... Like, if I read a message that says hidden wall ahead, I'm going to try it. Like, I'm just guaranteed going to try it. On principle, I'm going to try it. So belly rot. Bell belly rot? Why is it always you don't have the right? Ah, I don't believe it. Damn it. Hopefully this damn thing will tick up. Okay, this one doesn't say liar ahead. You motherfucker. You motherfucker, you. Uh... One of the, uh, what, let's see, people? <laughs> Liar ahead is fine. <laughs> this will carry me through the DLC for all the updutes that I will get. I'm guessing this doesn't open, right? I do not have the right. Okay, we're in the first legacy dungeon. Let's go, dude. This looks like a much more somber Lane Dell. Hi. <laughs> Spinning Stone 5? Spinning Stone 5? I mean, sure, but like, huh? I am shocked that that is not poison of some sort. Okay, let me lock on. I'm sorry, I don't want to lock on to the guys that are not attacking me. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Poop waterfall. Oh my god. Okay, you got a lot of health. One more, and you're dead. Dude, the, the power stance moveset is kind of sick, actually. Like, I, I like that little, like, spin move and then the overhead slam at the end. That shit's sick. Okay, there is something over here. I really thought for sure this was poison. It's just shit. It's all shit. Oh. Oh. Well, they won't they won't mind. They won't mind. A somber three, huh? I mean I don't mind that I'm getting like lower level stones. Oh, something that I did do off stream in preparation for this. Uh right, it's gonna be upgrade materials. Was I just bought a shitload of every stone. Um in case I wanna upgrade some stuff. But it seems like I will find more. I had five hundred K runes from uh from Elden Beast, and uh, I really did not feel like I desperately needed it to level anything up. Oh, it didn't even didn't even make it to him. Rock, enjoy the rock, bitch. <laughs> the, an the anchor is it's doing work. I don't like the way you're just walking towards me menacingly. I'd like to make you rethink that action. Uh, okay, there is... Let's see. Be wary of depths. You don't have the right ahead circling around. Key required ahead, therefore try left. Okay, we won't go down there yet. What the fuck? Don't do that! Hey, don't do that! Hey, please don't do that! <laughs> Mesmer Fire Grease. Are you waiting for your, uh, your streak to pop for the day? I'm dead. Okay, leave me alone there, brother. <laughs> I should have done literally anything but that, I think. <laughs> Just pretty much anything but that would have been great. <laughs> uh, all right. I just thought, you know, maybe... Get the other anchor out. What am I doing fooling around with spells? 
By that I mean incantations. Ow! The power stance move is actually, like, pretty fast. I mean, if I just two-hand one of the anchors, it's like... It's like about the same speed. And if it's not, it's close. Like, it's not so much slower that the trade-off isn't worth it. Ooh, I don't know how I'm not getting hit by those. I'm sorry, they have a reasonable hitbox? That's, that's insanity. You're supposed to have, like, fucking discs of light, freaky-ass hitbox. Fortnite. <laughs> Want to hustle? Yeah, BGB, I'm not sure what you're trying to say. <laughs> I'm assuming you're waiting for your, uh... Uh, for your streak, <laughs> though. Jeffy B won't give it to you. Okay. Let's heal. Before I get smoked by this. Dude, the poise damage this is doing is kind of insane. Ah, oh, that damage isn't actually all that bad. I expected much worse. Mm okay. A lot of you guys. I don't mind. You're kind of fun enemies. <laughs> I say as I have stun locked every single one of them. <laughs> they remind me just like a little bit of the uh, of the omens in the Lane Dell sewers. So I came all the way down here. But for what? For what purpose? Be wary of ambush, therefore seek right. Well. The ambush has already happened. It's already occurred. I don't know what, what I was meant to do over there. There was nothing down here? This is a dead end. Chin carry, skinny though he may be, is not skinny enough to squeeze through that. Leave me alone. Please. <laughs> Imagine there's a DLC weapon that does literally one damage. <laughs> they finally add the uh, uh, broken straight sword. Dude, you wouldn't be believe how many people I've watched play Elden Ring this week. Um, I can hear you. I can't hear you, but how's it going? It's going great. Um, I can't believe how many people I watched this week play Elden Ring that did not have the lantern. Oh, fuck. I forgot about you. I'm dead. I'm not dead. Dude, these guys... Oh, dude, they're, uh... They're... Undead settlement... Enemies. Right? Basically. So, uh, yeah, I don't... I don't know. I don't know what to do. Dead end after dead end after... I mean, like, I'm sure I just go a different way. Oh. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, I'm, I'm stupid. It turns out I'm actually just stupid. Try rolling, and then item. What do you know about that? What do you know about that, sir? You hiding something from me? Silverhorn tender. Is that anything like a chicken tender? <laughs> if not, then uh, no clue what that does. Oh, Grace. This game is very generous with the uh, checkpoints. After playing, uh, I guess Sekiro is the same way. But after playing a lot of Dark Souls 3 this year, that game is uh, was considered generous for its time, and it is significantly less generous with them than uh, than Elden Ring even is. 
I've been waiting a long time for this, bozos. I've been waiting a long fucking time. Locked. Whale. Okay, I can go out on the roofs here. This uh reminds me a lot of Landell. Like a Landell that you traverse from bottom to top rather than the other way around. So what's this way then? Big, big guy. I'll fight a big guy. Oh, you're a uh, omen killer. It kind of looks like. No, you're different. You certainly have higher poise <laughs> than the other enemies around here. All right, square up. You're cool. You're gonna kick my ass. I, I, I certainly see Stormvale. I think Stormvale and Landell kind of had like similar design philosophies when you uh, when you really break it down. Oh, and now someone else is. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. Okay, he's doing some like crazy ass crucible shit. That one's not him doing that. I don't think that's the other guy. Yeah, up there. I'd love it if you stopped. Excuse me, sir. This is Elden Ring DLC. It sure is. Yeah, it just came out today. Yes, sir. I, mean, I realize that sounds sarcastic, but yes, this actually is <laughs> Elden Ring DLC. Yeah, I, I can see like like a small Radon. I mean, I think it's just the two weapons that made it made me think of Omen Killer slash and or uh, uh, Capra Demon. I like the music here too. I bet this says "Be wary of right." <laughs> yep, yep. He didn't hit me though. I'm too I'm too smart for him. Oh, more poop water. Oh, shit. <laughs> Awkward. Uh-oh. Okay. All right, boys. Oh, no, no, no. You're not quite dead. Okay. The double anchor special. Definitely not the cat. Thank you for the follow. What's this way? Ambush ahead. There always is, isn't there? Are we at the top of the poop waterfall? Hey! Excuse me. Yeah, I swear that's that's like a undead settlement enemy. One of those dudes with the big cleavers. Wow. <laughs> the, the most dramatic like random hollow death. <laughs> ah, storeroom key. I wonder... Let's see, is this gonna loop back? Oh, I actually think it might. Oh, it's- we're on the other side of this. If only I could raise a bridge out of the poop water. Try jumping, then likely secret. I don't think so. I- I really don't think so. I'm looking. Maybe if I squint really hard, I'll see it. Man, it's really nice to just have like new Elden Ring to play. Is that is that crazy to say? I feel like no. But like, you know, it's still fun to replay this game. But like playing new content for the first time definitely like hits different. 
I still haven't gotten over that I'm pl playing like the DLC and not just like a fucking mod or something. <laughs> oh, what do we have here? Be wary of ah! Okay, it said be wary of right, but <laughs> I didn't even go right. Maybe they just mean in like a general cosmic sense. <laughs> Bad things happen when right. <laughs> yeah, that was crazy. Okay. Yeah, I'm starting to not like the, the bug theme here. <laughs> we got bug people. Mosquito people. Uh, I'm actually starting to think less so Landell. It, it, it looks like Landell, but like the enemy configurations and layouts and shit are starting to remind me a lot more of, uh, of Irithyll. Don't tell me that thing's waking up. Oh. You're just already awake. Ghost guys look like they could be weak to holy. Copium. <laughs> They're weak to everything. <laughs> I'm gonna be real. They're not very strong. At least so far. Okay, what is this? This looks important. Is that a rune? No, that's a new upgrade material that allows you to, like, level up in the DLC. It's kind of cool. Like, it makes you stronger within the DLC. I don't like that. I don't like any of that. You know what would be cool? If they made an enemy that, like, crawls up walls. That shit would be sick. <laughs> I mean, it would be terrible. But it'd be cool. Okay, I want to... There we go. <laughs> Who needs a fly swatter when you have a big fucking rusty anchor? Clang, 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 clang. That's that's what that's what we we be doing. Broken rune. Ugh! That one actually scared me. I did somehow did not see him. How'd you get up there, boss? Time for betrayal. What? Wait, what? Uh, what? Uh, um, um, what? <laughs> Excuse me! Five minutes into the DLC and we're already betraying people. I knew it would come to this. Is the big tree in the distance the Skadu tree by any chance? I just realized that. Because I have to- I have to say that's quite- uh, that name doesn't roll off the tongue quite as well as, uh, Erd tree. Although, to be honest, Halic tree doesn't really roll off the, uh, roll off the old tongue either. Love Piss Creek. Shit, bro, that is funny. <laughs> Shit, bro. Uh... That's good. <laughs> okay, okay, come on. Okay, come on. Okay, come on. What is this, Dark Souls 2? We fight locked off now? Got them stanky boluses. I used to think the word stanch was so funny. I kind of still do think it's funny. I'm gonna be real. Why does the word stanch mean what it means? Like, it means to, like, stop the flow of blood. <laughs> Why does the word stanch mean that? It sounds like it has something to do with, with scent. Yeah, it means to, like, stop the flow of blood, I believe. If you just, like, Google it, you probably get a better explanation, but... There's, like, some fucking, like, Halo ambient music going on in the background. Hey, buddy. Off the edge with ya! Oh, he lived. I really wish this was like, uh, Sekiro, where if you do a plunging attack, you just- Oh, he's on the thing! Oh, time to duel. Is this what this guy meant by time for betrayal? Wait, will he fall down? Oh, he fell down. Man, it would have been cool to- to duel up on the circle. Okay.
Not him cheating at sumo wrestling. Yeah, I didn't even get in the ring yet. He made it personal. Nice try. Although, I have to say, bringing two rusty anchors into the sumo ring is probably also frowned upon. I'm gonna be real, bro. I didn't want to kill you, but my thing locked onto you automatically. Therefore, that means war. Wow. Oh. Hello. Can you backstab these guys, you think? Oh, God. Okay. Okay, Gundir. Chill, bro. Chill. Oh, my God. I'm dead. <laughs> what the fuck? What was I supposed to do? <laughs> what if you have anchors for hands? Chin anchor hands. I went way back, and I'm not so happy about it. Man, I gotta fight this guy again. I'm gonna lose all my fucking souls. Z runes is what they're called in this game. Duh. I'm not stupid. How is, like, the dual sword guy easier? You're cool, but, like, come on. When's it my turn? Okay, thank God that second one clipped him. Jesus Christ. I didn't even, like, open a shortcut or anything. Wait, is this different? Holy shit, whatever this is, I have not been down here. Okay. I have aggroed the whole town, though. They all hate me. Okay. Oh, shut the fuck up. Get out of here. I'm not fighting you. Quilligan. We have Quilag at home? Whoa. That's not what I expected you to do. Oh, look at this fuck-ass haircut, bro. <laughs> oh, you're... It's, it's like, honestly just over for you. <laughs> Nicholas said it's my turn to whoop your ass. So true. Ooh, he's... Ah! I thought he was about to do a little, like, Rykard shit. Rykard's Ranker type, type beat. Nope. God, I really wanted to just fully flatten him, but I'm trying to play safe here so I don't lose all those roots. Ow. That attack is just mean. <laughs> it's actually kind of a cool invader, I won't even lie. <laughs> the feudal peasant cut is too accurate, honestly. I keep like... I was like, I, I turned on like just recording for uh... just to capture like my reaction to... like my initial impression of the DLC and then I just kept it going. And then I turned it off because I was like, oh that guy was much easier that time. Then I turned it off because I was like, well, I'm just kind of exploring right now. I'll just, I'll just, uh, you know, replay buffer stuff that is cool. But then I hit the replay buffer, like, more times in, like, the, the amount of time that it lasts. Uh, then, like, uh, I, I'm, I'm describing this horribly, but basically I just decided to, uh, to start recording it. Can I see your stats? Yeah. I'm trying to level Faith to cast more incants. Uh, I might push Vigor to 60, depending on how hard we're getting hit in the DLC. But otherwise, it's pretty much a pure strength build. I, su I suppose Endurance wouldn't be, like, a, a terrible thing to level, either. Of the grace of gold shall Could I stab him in the back? Where does he pop in? In the embrace of Mesmer's flame. <laughs> okay. Nope. Do not do that. <laughs> oh, he's got he's got hyper armor.
button just not work? Hit the death button. There we go. Yeah, there's nothing, like, particularly interesting about my stats. It really just became a pure strength build. I should not have buffered another one. Ow. Didn't know the green giant used weapons? <laughs> uh, of course he does. I bet Wild Strikes eats this guy for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. <laughs> that's- that's- that's what we've been ignoring here. Sometimes one anchor may just be better than two. Dude. You are so cringe. Shriek of Sorrow. Oh, new Ash- Okay. <laughs> so, that was over before it even began. Quelin! Is that how you say that? Quelin? We are so fucking back, baby. Okay, well... Didn't quite get the job done there. I'd really like it if you stopped, to be honest. Kinda waiting for your move. What? Why? Why does that have, like, three follow-ups? Stop. Dude, spears are so fucking annoying. Okay, so when am I really supposed to roll for that? <laughs> you are so fucking annoying. You're so fucking annoying, bro. We want the anchor for this. <laughs> I'm just... Uh... Okay. Oh, you know what I could do? Uh, let's f just fight this guy first. I I'm pretty sure I have enough of the scatter tree blessings to level up again. What's up, pillow? Of the grace of gold shall all meet God, you're you're so cringe. Shut up. See you next Tuesday, bitch. <laughs> I love this game. Uh, okay, that is a new uh, talisman, I think. Is it? It is. Raises attack power after defeating an enemy. Oh. That's kind of interesting. Probably marginally useful, but... Something new, at least. Damn, all right. <laughs> I can't believe that. I died to that guy like three times, and then on the third time, just he didn't even get an attack off. Is that it? Is this a, is this a dead end otherwise? Uh, kind of looks like maybe we... Question is, is there anything up here? Arrow. Poggers. <laughs> What about over here? What about, about over here? What about over here? Got my first 300k plus Bellatro build? Let's go. What do you need to win uh, anti-8 on white stake? It's like 250k or something. Is it even that much? I forget. I, I, haven't, I haven't been playing on white stake much lately. Okay, well, that's everything. Obelisk, huh? Uh, and Ancient, Ancient Joker, I think. I don't think I've had, like, a good run with Obelisk ever, basically. 
I just... It's awkward. <laughs> it's very awkward. You need to play, like, a lot of high card or something to, to get it to scale appropriately. Like, just play a bunch of, like, awkward high cards and then, like, play something else for, like, your final hand. What are you? Oh, you just got the... Get them glowing eyes. That means you drop lots and lots of runes. Put pair to set. I, I may be not understanding your build here, but having pair on seven does not sound like... Like, enough to get obelisk value, but maybe I'm just not quite understanding what you were doing. Okay, so this is the one side of Shitsville, and I guess we do just have to circle around. And then the old shit waterfall. I'll leave you alone. <laughs> There's just a lot of different hands. I guess that works then, yeah. You at least have, like, you could make that hand seven different times. I think that's my issue with Obelisk, is that it's counterintuitive to the way that I like to play the game, which is, like, narrowing in on one hand and just making that one hand. And so I, I find it hard to get use out of it, but... I, I can recognize that accruing a lot of x bolt is obviously a good thing. Whoa, you're... I have not been up here before because I don't recall you. Like the thrill of it? Certainly, like, anything that causes you to sort of have to play differently is, is cool in my book. Um, that's what I've enjoyed about... Um, about playing gold stake is that like having things like rental jokers like really makes you think about the game differently <laughs> um, And you just start taking any joker that can help you um, Which leads to some interesting scenarios. Hey come over here. I just don't want to aggro this other guy Okay, you're really just gonna make this as annoying as possible. Aren't you? Holy fuck stop. Oh my god. I'm going off the edge. I'm alive? That's absurd. That is borderline unbelievable. You love black deck? Surely you're joking. <laughs> Surely that's a joke, right? Black deck is the worst deck in the game, like, objectively and by far. <laughs> I think it sounds cool to have an extra joker slot, uh, and it is. It's just everything else about that deck that is not cool. That's unbelievable that I survived that fall. I didn't even take fall damage, period. Lots of low-level smithing stones. I'm, I'm surprised. I'm not mad about it, though. Oh, here's a guy with a big pot. Wait, wait, I want to see what he does. Throw it! What? Uh-oh. For some reason, yellow deck hates me. See, and that's the best one. <laughs> that is, like, the best one of the game. Although I understand it doesn't really have like a straightforward benefit. It's just like more money means you can kind of more quickly do whatever you want. Oh, we're back here. How did I... How did I get here before? I guess I came... Up this way? Huh. Oh. Hide. Okay, he's about to look right at me. I really... Ooh! <laughs> Last second dodge. I'm just stun locked. I can't move. <sighs> Fucking dude, I don't know what to do about this move set at all. Okay, at least I, I know how to get up here now. I was so lost for a while there. <laughs> Fucking god. That's the boss. That's the boss right there.
They just stunt. Yeah, dude. He is the main character. All right, I forgot about you. These are Sekiro enemies. Like, not actually, but like, I, I want to be deflecting you right now, not dodge rolling you. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, it's just, it's, it's a lot. <laughs> That's a lot going on there. Oh, I, I was not in that radius. I'm getting hella runes, though. Ow. Shit. Alright, here's what we do. Check it. I died. <laughs> I died. I lost a whole bunch of runes, too. <laughs> I was like 100k. Cool. Cool. No, it's fine. It's fine. We are rapidly approaching 25, but... <laughs> we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Sometimes that guy's easy, and sometimes he's hard. Okay, there we go. Silverhorn Tender. Well, that can't be a very special item, because I'm getting them fucking left and right. Did I just aggro one of them? That would be really nice if so. And I'm just, uh, I'm happy to be back. It hasn't, like, registered that I'm, like, playing new Elden Ring. Like, I it's still, I'm just kind of, like, going through the motions. Can we go up to the roof? I mean, the birds suck, but... I think in general, this is probably a better way to go. What's this way, then? Oh, uh, scorpions. I mean, scorpions are not, like, a huge problem. Oh, this is just, like, the other way. I see. Oh. Oh, brother. <laughs> is that all of them? Okay, nope. It's never all of them. It's never all of them. What am I saying? It's never all of them. You're dead, kiddo. I don't like their fucking incessant dive bombing. Th these are not the worst uh, flying enemies I've encountered, though. <laughs> not even close. In fact, they may even be the best. That doesn't mean they're not still flying enemies. We'll just put it that way. Okay, this guy, are you like a scarab? Like, if I kill you, do you... Okay, you do drop something. Golden Horn Tender. <laughs> ah, the Golden Tendy. Finally. Uh, I'm gonna die to this guy, right? Like... Eat rock! Just ah! <laughs> I just I can't move. He hits me and then I can't move. I, that time I was stuck in a fucking corner. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm so done with this run back to him too. Poise boys, yeah, I got I got no fucking poise. Is it DLC? Yup. 
Yes, indeed. Yeah, we got none of we got none of that poise business here. Now, oh, I'm so, I'm so sick of this. I want to make progress. I want to find a shortcut or something. I guess like the way I'm going kind of is the shortcut. I just do this. There's no like real drop attack in this game. But it does make it easier to isolate these guys. They don't notice. Gonna watch VOD later after I beat it myself? Yeah, fair enough. Thanks for stopping by. There's an enemy that's just a massive hive mind of ants and they can shapeshift and take any form they want. Don't give Miyazaki any ideas, bro. <laughs> the black flame birds are kind of cool. I cannot tell a lie. That said, they haven't done anything to me other than just like spam that one move. Does the guy that normally stands there and casts that thing, like, fall off the edge? Holy shit, stop. There's gotta be a bug boss somewhere. Elden Ring does kinda have some bug bosses. Now granted, they're not like normal bugs. It's like freaky, like, pincers on... I uh, just... I already got your thing. What do I even do here about this guy? I mean... I'm supposed to kick him off the bridge, right? Dude, what is that? God, the, the speed of that is just absurd. Uh, I'm so mad. <laughs> this is stealth count? That's kind of what I was talking about, yeah. Freaky skull guy with pincers. I, I, this guy is unbelievable. How's the DLC going? Uh, so far, good. I just hate this, like, one enemy that I'm fighting. See, this guy isn't even hard. Like, he his attacks look crazy, but, like... <laughs> I don't think this guy has ever killed me. <laughs> but his bro up on the bridge has killed me like five times now. <laughs> that has been literally like half my deaths in the entire DLC. And the other half was to that invader. <laughs> Just about. Lock onto this guy. I set alarm for stream, but I slept through it. I mean, you kind of like woke up when I normally start, but I started a little early, so you missed like an hour, but no big deal. I mean, I'm sorry, unacceptable, my unpaid volunteer moderator. How dare you miss even a second of stream? Oh boy, can't wait to die to this fuck-ass knight again. Dude, wow, they just stretch out for that one. Stop. <laughs> Please stop. I swear, this guy just chooses when he wants to spawn. What are you doing? <laughs> okay. I'll accept that. Imagine an anchor throwable. God, I wish. Do you drop this thing every time? No, you don't. It's like a chance drop. All right. 
Oh, my pot. All right, I just got to get hits in where I can, I think. That's the... That's the goal. Not there. We're learning the dance. Jesus! Gundir! It's actually Gundir. Only Elden Ring would have just, like, actually champion Gundir in the game and not even give him a bo boss health bar. That's such a fucking joke, bro. <laughs> This guy's a- this guy is a boss. <laughs> Effectively. I've died enough times that I declare him a boss. Why is this dual sword bro so much easier? I say right before I die to this guy too. Okay. How about we just die? Okay. Or that. Now I'm struggling with this guy. <laughs> Love the no wind-up shoulder check. He took that one right out of Gundyr's playbook. Oh my god. He just keeps doing his most annoying combo. And look at that, he's doing it again. How about now? I'm... I was like, straight up, I'm gonna go back, but nah, I still have seven flasks. <laughs> nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. I feel like I've been in this exact area for so fucking long. He'll get his own wheel spin at this point? Literally, though. I mean, hey, I never said it had to be on a boss. Uh, it's just every 25 deaths. But God, I hope not. <laughs> For my pride. I don't even care that much, like, the punishments aren't that bad. Realistically. The punishments are more fun than they are bad. But at this point, for my pride, I don't wanna... I don't wanna admit defeat to this guy. Oh, I keep... I keep forgetting that I have enough of the fragments to level up, probably. I'm gonna have to remember that. It's gonna... It's gonna take me a while to, like, remember to check for that. Okay, this guy flies in. We don't bother with the Black Flame guy. Sometimes you fly at the edge, too, which is really cool. Did you watch the launch trailer? I didn't, because people said it was spoilery. Although, my counterpoint to that uh, is just, like, how the f <laughs> like the trailers are so incomprehensible. Like... The only way it spoils anything is if you already know what the story is. Um, but no, the the answer is I did not, uh, and I probably won't, just because, like, if it's got spoilery stuff in it, I'd rather just avoid it. Okay. Rocks. Here he comes! Just get way the fuck out of the way of that. Round seven. But who's counting, really? Not me. Spam roll for the win. Nope. Did, did I really not roll that? <laughs> I, I could just run. I, I could just run past him. <laughs> I could just. I, I feel like at this point, on principle, I'm not going to, but I could just run past him. The fact that I'm already getting my ass kicked by not even like a like a mini boss, but basically like an elite enemy. Oh god. Does not bode well. How are you not dead? Okay, I'm stuck. 
cool. Cool guy. Very cool guy. You're such a cool guy. Wow. Is that what you want me to say? Is that what you want me to say, motherfucker? You're so cool. <laughs> Yeah, but that'd be admitting defeat. This, see, this is why, this is why it was so nice to play uh, my first playthrough of Elden Ring off stream. Elden Ring so much better when you don't got a bitch in your ear telling you, no, you can't run past that. You gotta fight it. <laughs> and the worst part is they're they're right. The worst part is you're right. I'm going to fight it. <laughs> but off stream, let me tell you, I would have had no shame running past that dude. <laughs> Oh yeah, the, uh, God, the, um, the Banished Knights in Fair Missoula. Nah, it's not a big deal. I, I actually am just kind of enjoying soaking it up right now. Although I am, I am over this particular section of, uh, Belurat or whatever the hell this place is called. Um, funny story about the Banished Knights. I didn't have too much trouble fighting them, uh, like individually, but I did not. Oh, what is that? I don't think I can jump across there. Um, I did not know about the grace that's closer to the Godskin duo. So I just kept fighting them over and over again every time on my run back to Godskin duo. Because if you don't kill them, they just gank you. It was fucking miserable. But I got really good at fighting them. So now I have no, now I have no trouble fighting them. <laughs> Imagine my surprise when after like... Like 20, 30 attempts on uh, Godskin Duo. See, this guy's here now. Why? After like 20, 30 attempts on Godskin Duo, I watched like a streamer or someone else do it, and I noticed they were going from a completely different grace, and I was like, are you fucking kidding me? That grace is so hidden for no good reason. Like, why is it like that? <laughs> You literally have to loop around, like, the entire building and fight, like, 15 more Banished Knights just to get there and then not have to, like, fight all those Banished Knights every single time. Okay, we don't want to roll away from that. This is... Oh, that last one's so fast. Or that second to last one, I guess. See, this, this guy reminds me of, like, a fucking Lies of P enemy. Because I hate him. <laughs> I'm getting hit. Yeah, I, I keep forgetting that as a shockwave. Okay, the shoulder check. I hate. He's got that closing speed, bro. Come on. Yeah! Get fucked. <laughs> it took me goddamn long enough. Horned warrior hell. <laughs> Just still the next boss. <laughs> Just still the next boss, okay? Okay, we'll, we'll put the gold mask back on. Don't worry. Just still the next boss. <laughs> I gotta I gotta wear the head of my enemy here. Dude, imagine if I die. If I die, I'm running past him. I, I don't even care. Actually, the goat mask. So true. Ladder? Where's it go? Leave me alone! <laughs> oh! Oh. I was not expecting that. Yeah, it looks like there's three anchors. Yeah, I love just having, like, a fucking mess of, like, things around my head. <laughs> you didn't see anything. Bucko. Okay, so this is, like, a full loop back. Interesting. I, I wasn't really expecting that. Okay. Instead of doing that, how about we not... I wonder if that guy was a one-time spawn with a guaranteed drop. One-time spawn, no. Guaranteed drop, yes. <laughs> I'm calling it now. All right, I didn't rest. So, of course he's not there. Oh, this kind of looks like a run-up to a boss. I won't even lie. 
Ah, the spirit ash up. Stop. You know what this area really is with the, the AoE guys? That's the fucking Ring City. <laughs> We're just going backwards through the Ring City. Like those pots just jiggling around. That's very satisfying. Upgrade. Oh, that's a good question. If upgrading the rats gives me more rats. I don't think it does. I don't think it does. It probably just upgrades their damage. But boy, would that be something. Uh, actually, this doesn't really look like a boss room. Item ahead, therefore, try right. Finally, some fucking... Some good fucking food. <laughs> Uh. Seek grace, so to speak. Time for running. Oh, God. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I, I see what you're saying here. <laughs> did he die? I'm sorry, did he just, did he just front flip off the edge? <laughs> okay, some problems just solve themselves, really. Now, this looks like a boss area. Okay, we definitely have a scatter tree blessing. Uh, empower. Oh, I think it just upgrades all your spirit ashes. Holy shit, bro! The rats are getting so so strong. They're getting so big for me. <laughs> summon sign. I don't think I want to summon. So this is definitely a boss. All right, um, let's check it out. Oh, this is going to be the lion dance, motherfucker, isn't it? All right. Th this guy looks so... This is one of the bosses that I've seen. Um, it's probably the one I've seen the most of. Who's talking? I got spoiled on just this boss, but it, it was in a lot of the promo material. I only know this boss, the next boss, and I know that Mesmer exists, and that's it. <laughs> I, I, I'm mostly scared. This thing looks like it has really, like, unnatural movements, which is cool, but I feel like it's going to be pain to dodge. Is that other dude they showed a pick of on Steam? Are you talking about the guy who's like ripping his head off? I don't even know if that guy's a boss. Uh, and if, if someone knows, don't spoil please. But I'm just saying, I, I'm not sure if that guy's a boss. That is so cool. <laughs> Alright, first boss time, baby. Divine Beast Dancing Lion. Oh my god, listen to this music. Oh, that's good. That's, that's alright damage. Okay. Hitting him is hard, though. Oh my god. Okay, you can like... Okay. I can't- I can't tell if you want to be close in for that, or if you want to be farther and try to jump the shockwaves. <laughs> Interesting. Wow, the music! The music is sick! Oh my god, he- he makes it kind of hard to, like, retaliate. Uh. Be jumping that is not the way. Woo! So he just kicked me with his ass. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Hey bud, when do I heal? Just like a, a quick question. Oh fuck, that's a lot of runes. <laughs> Alright, they're gone. <laughs> I kind of think maybe you just don't heal in this boss. <laughs> so far. <laughs> so far, it kind of feels like maybe this is a no healing zone. <laughs> D 
The music is so cool. It sounds like what I wish the Sekiro soundtrack sounded like. Dude, all right, that, that was just a bad time to, to try and heal. But apparently it all is, huh? Okay, that's a little more delayed than I, what? What even? Hit me. It was that was an attack? <laughs> I'm I'm just I'm finding myself just confused by this boss here. <laughs> He's very mobile. Which is kind of deceptive. Like how the hell do you tell what what it's doing like half the time. Okay, that's a that's a healing window right there, if I ever saw one. <laughs> the way he moves is super cool though. Okay, that's a little more distance than I thought you might have there. Oh, the tail, the tail. These attacks are cool, but like... Okay, that has a follow-up. That must be what hit me. <laughs> okay. Getting a little space from him is actually effective. That's good to know. Oh, he's changing? Oh! Uh-oh. Oh no, I'm stuck. <laughs> I'm stuck in the lightning. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> All the cloth and shit makes it really hard to judge its dimensions. I yeah, I think it's like <laughs> It's literally Vincent adult man. Like, it's it's multiple guys in a suit. Like, it, it's multiple omens wearing, like, a lion head in a suit. <laughs> like, am I crazy? I think it's, like, two guys under there. I think? I can't tell. Maybe it is just one. No, there's definitely two. Okay, did not see that coming. Ow. <laughs> really didn't do that much damage. I think I just got caught in the shockwave. Ow, that tail kick just is so deceptive. Really? So lucky that missed me. Let's face transition. That's what you're doing. Where do I go? I don't know where to go during this. Like, he just doesn't stop. Hello? Oh my god. Dude, what the fuck? What do you do? Uh, so I'm in the lightning, I'm just... Next thing you know, I'm in the fucking lightning. <laughs> what do you do? It's very, it's very like creative and unique feeling boss. I haven't decided if that's a good thing or not yet. Um, get good. Oh, you're right. My bad. 
I forgot about that part. Ow, I so rolled. You know what it kind of reminds me of is Ludwig Phase 1. And I'm not like the biggest Ludwig Phase 1 enjoyer. I don't understand that attack in the slightest. That actually doesn't have a ton of rage. You can kind of just run away from it. My dog when it's hungry. <laughs> Dude, I, I actually don't understand that attack in the slightest. <laughs> if I could, like, hover above the ground before I attack, that would be sick. <laughs> Unfortunately, I cannot do that. <laughs> Camera doing wonders here. I'm dead. I'm dead because I don't fucking understand this attack. <laughs> I think maybe you just can't roll away from it. Because it has that weird follow up that looks like nothing. We are speed running to 25 here. Does anyone want to tell me what the fuck is going on there? <laughs> like, I'm looking at that attack and I'm gleaning no information from it. <laughs> he becomes like a wind vortex in midair for like three seconds and then eventually just damage it gets dealt. Um, I was going to do something, but now I can't remember what it was. I was, I was trying to see at, like how close I, I could get away with getting to him. Turns out not very close. It's crazy to see a four digit damage number and the, the bar, like the actual damage bar is not big. Yeah, I think this boss is really interesting, and I would agree that, like, I don't understand what it's doing. Like, I would be having a, a more fun time if, like, I could see its, like, you know, arms and legs. <laughs> to, like, what is that? does so much damage. Oh, I should check out what, what's in my physics here, because I think it's, like, nothing good right now. Or my physics flask, I should say. A 
Okay, I dodged that, but I really don't know how. I just spammed. He kind of has, like, a Madeir thing going on where, like, the head, the head re resets, like... After the attacks. I don't think the head is extra damage, but, like, you can kind of tell when he has, like, a damage window. Because of the way that works. I feel like you just have to double roll everything because of the lightning. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Yeah, I, I I don't think I'm <laughs> I'm enjoying this boss. I think it's neat. I wish I could understand better like what it's doing like all the time. This was when I saw this boss in the trailers, this was my worry with it, was that it would just be like way too inscrutable. And it is. Also, can it be poise broken? If it can, I sure haven't done it with two colossal weapons yet. Or not colossal weapons, but great axes, I guess. What the fuck? Okay. Glitching out a little bit there. Okay. I do not have the evidence yet to suggest that the lightning phase is possible. <laughs> I'm sure it is, but I, I, I sure also don't understand it. Okay, I, we just run away from this one. Jump if we must. That's okay, lightning time. It's not lightning time. What? It's no wind-up. That does not have a wind-up. I refuse to believe that that constitutes a wind-up. I just... What is going on? You, you can't attack him. I jumped, but fine. <sighs> okay, so let's look at something here. <laughs> Physic. <laughs> the Twiggy cracked tear. Woo! Um, the bubble tier is always a good one. Boost all damage negation. So maybe we want to do... This is a good combo, I think. Oh. Hello, I would like to switch this one. Thank you. <laughs> um, ooh, and then Talisman. I have not been doing jump attacks, so maybe jump attack is unnecessary. I don't have the lightning. Okay. Where is that? Extra life. Where is the lightning negation one? The talisman. Bolt Drake Talisman? Plus two location. What the fuck is this? Dragon Temple Rooftop. Oh. Is it Faramazula?
Um. Whale. <laughs> this is damage and impact of headshots. Like, if I'm getting headshots, I'll, I, okay, I, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go to 25. It's literally just two more deaths, and then I will, I will reassess my situation. Love how I can see what you're doing. Oh, that's a bite. Great attempt. Yeah. Great fucking attempt. I'm dead. No, I'm not. The fact that he can immediately go into that is just stupid. I rolled, but okay. No, we're not. I, 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 uh, I have words for this boss. <laughs> it's evil. It's very cool, but it's evil. I, I just, ah, uh, forget about understanding what the hell the boss is doing, man. This is basically like fighting a fucking, uh, tree spirit. All right, we got to spin the wheel. Let me get that ready. Hello? The wheel! Alright. Spin the punishment wheel. We spin the side quest wheel. And then we take our pick. Change weapon infusion is for sure a no-go. Add plus one hour to the next truckathon. Consider it done. <laughs> Consider it done. Plus one hour to the truckathon it is. <laughs> oh man. Okay, but I would like to go get that uh that talisman from Fair Missoula. Show lands between map. There we go. How long is the truckathon now? I think it's 13 hours, yes. <laughs> I believe so. Okay, let me read these instructions quick. You'd head southeast to the large plaza guarded by the stationary Ferramazula Dragon, which is constantly raining red lightning all around the arena. Sounds lovely. From here, look northeast, then drop down a series of cliffs to reach the opening at the bottom of a large building. Okay. We'll start there. There is like six steps. Oh, the fucking birds. Something tells me... Hello? Oh, how I miss the fucking Bellarot birds already. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, a flight pinion? Wow, wow, that's so useful. I'm so glad I got that. <laughs> Fuck ass birds. Uh oh. Ow. Dude, go away. Go the fuck away. <laughs> fuck off. Genuinely fuck off. Wow, it's like I never left the, <laughs> the fucking stupid lion boss. Okay, it said from here, head northeast. Christ. Something about dropping down some cliffs? 
I don't think I've ever done this before. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> I actually don't think I've ever done this before. Uh-oh. No, it's fine. I was I was never worried. Okay, we're good. No, I, I sure have done this. Yeah, looking at this building over here, I definitely recognize this. Faramazula is is cool. There's I'm always like finding new shit that I didn't know about here. Or maybe not didn't know about, but like forgot about. Cause like I'm pretty sure I've been here, but like I definitely forgot about this. Try again. Oh. Interesting. Very interesting, sir. Okay, wait, what, what is next? Uh oh, wait, there's another one up ahead. We get in a safe spot to open up Fex for life. Um, let's see. Following the linear path here to a balcony with a ladder leading up to a terrace, mind the banished knights patrolling the area. All right, way ahead of you. Directly in front of the ladder is a lift building. To your left is a chest with the dragon tower shield. Okay. How'd the DLC start? Like, like, what do you mean, how did it start? There's a... There's an NPC, like, outside of Mikola's cocoon now that, like, kind of... Um, talks to you, and then you just touch the hand and you, you're you just in. That's it. The, the view from where you start is fucking beautiful. Uh, like, okay, so that's the, the lift. But yeah, there, there wasn't too much to it. All right, check it. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Spin to win, baby. I see you looking at me. No, 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 no. The NPC come with? Presumably, it's the, it's the lady from the trailers. Um, I, I assume she'll be, uh, making another appearance, but I haven't seen her again yet. Dude, I'm so pissed. <laughs> I just want this goddamn... Why did it have to be in Fair Missoula, man? <laughs> Let me alone, birds, birds, bird moment. What talisman is this? This is the uh, the best base game lightning protection talisman, the Bolt Drake Great Shield, something like that. Oh fuck! I think I'm dead. I'm cooked. Well, he cooked all the birds. It's chicken for dinner, sir. Would you go away? Pretty sure you can make him go away by just hitting him a few times, but I ain't got all day. <laughs> I ain't got all day, I say, as I continue dying. <laughs> oh, I, yeah, I'm not counting that death, by the way. I actually forgot to even count it, but like, I'm not in the DLC, right? Does it, does that count? <laughs> I feel like no. Oh God, all day looks at tomorrow's stream. He did in fact have all day. Oh, you attack a little faster than me, which is a bit of a problem concerning what I would like to do to you, which is hit you over and over again with a rusty anchor. Am I out of stamina?
Yeah, I feel like I feel like counting overworld deaths is is incorrect. No. Yeah, it do, you're right. It does say DLC deaths. I guess it could just be like playthrough deaths, but nah. I'm fine with this. <laughs> I believe you can. Oh, he he didn't see me. <laughs> Okay, like, yeah, that's fine. And then I can get a backstab on you, which makes you considerably easier. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Easy game! Literal baby food! <laughs> oh, that's actually not what I want. Okay, what's next then? The passage ahead- Jesus Christ, this is like a- this is actually a six-step process. Passage ahead as a crucible knight, fighting a couple of beastmen. Fight your way through the hallway, or just run past. Yes, can do. To reach a ladder at the end, climb up the ladder to reach an open window where the, the corpse holding the talisman can be found. Jesus Christ. Where do I actually go? Up the lift? <laughs> that was hilarious. Look at that face. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say I maybe have never done this. Because this does not look familiar at all. I thought I really thoroughly explored Faramazula in my first playthrough. But I think I just was like, fuck that dragon, I'm running past. And then did just that. Oh god, I'm scared. Oh, leave me alone, leave me alone. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Holy shit. You gotta leave me alone, bro. Oh no. I'm- I'm dead, and I'm really mad about it. Come all the way out here. Even farther, if it- if it please you. Jesus Christ. Please, 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 please. Do Crucible Knights climb? <laughs> bad, bad day to find out that that, that uh, is a thing. Get me the fuck out of here. Oh no, I'm, the bird's aggroed on me. Burge. Now, where is this leading me? Oh! That's cool. It's like a full loop back. That's some tracking the Crucible dude got. Welcome to Crucible Knights. They're actually not bad enemies. I would go as far as to say that they're, uh... They're one of my favorite enemies in the game. I don't know which grace I was at. Truth be told. This one. Cool. Good guess. Alright. It's not going 25 more, I'll tell you that much. Wait. Is this the one I got? Yeah, it must be. I was not paying attention. What was the other one I got? I got like the... I got literally like a worse tower shield than this, didn't I? Plus two is the one I got. Okay. Just making sure. Just making sure. The other one was a shield, like an actual shield. Yeah, and I think... But the thing is... I got- I had this one from the Halig tree. Oh, it was- it was actually a shield. Oh, that's so funny. I was like, wait, I should have gotten another one of these, but nope. Okay. Back to hell. <laughs> I 
I hate this fucking game. Why am I playing this? <laughs> oh, dude, I, I hate this shit. <laughs> The B button does not do anything, it turns out. I are, I, I, uh, is the whole DLC gonna be like this, bro? <laughs> to say it ain't so. What is the hitbox? Genuinely, what is the hitbox? Okay, it's like a delayed... You just gotta be ready because you can do that right after. And that's an attack. Today, I fucking learned. Get ready to learn Chinese, buddy, is what this guy said to me. <laughs> it's, it's so funny. That's a cool attack. I can't lie. No, it's just the stagger. Oh, what the fuck? What are you shooting at? Okay, lightning. Let's do this. Forget about it, I guess. What the hell? Okay, this is new. I haven't seen that. Right, the breath. Wow, that that is way less damage now. Oh, something else now? What is this? Like cold? Okay. This seems more reasonable somehow. I don't think I want to go towards that. Oh, it goes towards me even better. Jesus. Jesus. I wonder if he's gonna use fire? Yeah, probably. So you can't... <laughs> I fucking, like, charm up in the middle of the fight? That'd be funny. What the hell is happening? My game is lagging bad, and I can't see. Great fight, Miyazaki. You fucking nailed it, dude. What a cool fight. I'm glad I can see anything. Man, if you roll into that one, it's so good.
This is really just a, like, kind of keep up the aggression phase one. Like, you kind of just want to roll so that you land right next to him and then just whack him. How goes the DLC? It's going. I don't like this boss, I don't think. I don't know, it's interesting. I'm not sure if that's a compliment, though. Uh, that, I gotta, I always gotta be aware of that follow-up, man. Lightning time. Ow. Ow. This is impossible. He makes like a ring of lightning. You can kind of, if you're, if you play your cards right, you can kind of stand in the middle of it. Sort of like run sideways here. Roll maybe, yeah. Godric, I see you. Okay. This motherfucker does not have a poise meter. I'm dead. No, I'm not, actually. Very surprising. He's changing again? Oh, no, this is ice. That was, like, wind. Ow. Cool. <laughs> Breath. That's fine. I don't think I can even be near you when you're in this phase, really. Okay, frostbite, that blows. Wind again? Okay, this is just, this is just phase two, is all this. Oh fuck, I hate the lightning so much! I don't know. Wait, he's like combining them now! He's combining them! I'm dead. <laughs> okay, that was finally a good attempt. I, I think I've at least seen the bag of tricks. <laughs> I think I've at least seen the bag of tricks. I think something I want to do is, like, run up to him when he does the phase transition. Because that's not an attack. And then he rests for a second after that. Like, I think that is, like, damage window right there. Hey, thank you, cat named Robin. This fight is interesting. I'm slowly figuring it out. I can't say this one's maybe going down in the history books as one of my favorite fights, but we're getting there. He, he definitely randomly cycles through them, yeah. Okay, that's so easy if you just roll through it. Right, I always forget about this somehow. He does it after every time. I really just need to get used to getting ready to dodge that. I just need to get ready to learn Chinese. Here we go. Here, here's what we do. <laughs> Great plan. Nailed it. When's it my turn? 
There's some damage. Nah, he moves faster than I thought out of that one. I don't even know what's happening. The tornado's pretty fucking cool. Okay, that has a follow-up. Woo-hoo-hoo! -hoo! Okay, buddy. Right, that's... The tail whip is wind. Ah, uh, the follow-up. I was not ready for that. The stomp! He's got Horfrost Stomp! <laughs> okay, that sucked. Lightning. No Flask. No Flaskarino remaining. It's like he knows when I pop the bubble tier to do that. Oh, he's changing. No, he's not. I just don't know what he's doing. It turns out. Will I ever? This is my remaining question about the divine lion beast. Ow. Come on, man. I rolled! I think I think I just had to end lag on that attack there. Nah, we got this MF. We got this MF. I'm kind of like the the attack windups feel really like inscrutable and unfair, but like when you start getting it, it like it feels pretty good. I don't know, man. Maybe I just need to trust the vision here. <laughs> it certainly feels dance like. Uh oh. Hello. I'm just rolling because I have no idea where I am. It's a strategy, trust. Oh, that still hit me? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Boys break. I don't think it exists on this boss. Dude, it's so- I, I keep thinking it's like- I get like Nameless King flashbacks, and then the next thing you know, I'm on the ground getting hit by lightning. Changing. Know what that is okay it's like a it's like a double double bite follow-up attack gaming uh oh yeah baby get the fuck out of here get ready to learn chinese buddy <laughs> oh that was a remembrance Holy shit, bro.
That's an intense fight. I, I will say it's, it's odd. It's a very strange fight. I have to hand it to Miyazaki. <laughs> Bro is still throwing new shit at me after how many games? Um, I can't say it was like my favorite boss of all time, but I, I came around to it. Jesus Christ though, man. Wow, what a fight. It, it certainly had its ups and downs. Uh, wow, that wasn't even a level. It doesn't even drop a full level. Actual DLC moment. Um, okay. I think I'm going to at least pop enough runes to level up here. You should see the helmet. Oh, man. <laughs> is it silly? <laughs> Perhaps this DLC is just Chin Carry wearing the, the heads of his foes. <laughs> uh, is it is it a remembrance thing? Dude, deadass, I think we just need Vigor. <laughs> what I need is maybe to go find some Sacred Tears as well. You picked it up. Oh, the thing in the corner? Yeah, I didn't even look. I'm, I'm stupid. Uh, show me armor. <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> I do like it. It makes it, like, hard to see, truth be told. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, I'm gonna take a quick break to go to the bathroom and fill up my water, which is now empty. Uh, but, hey, good shit. Lots more of this coming up. <laughs>